This is Matt Russell from the FX Power Course, and welcome to the Daily FX Walkthrough. So here are the four pairs that I will be discussing this evening, the Kiwi Dollar, Aussie Dollar, Euro Dollar, and the Dollar Yen. So let's go ahead and pull up the charts. The first chart is the Kiwi Dollar. This is now the daily chart. I mentioned this trade in yesterday's report. All previous reports are located directly above this video if you're viewing this on the Daily FX forum. So yesterday's report, I mentioned the possibility for a triple bottom. I personally entered uh, just above that 52 figure, placing a stop around 51.40, and prices did uh, find a bottom, at least a temporary bottom, and prices have rebounded sharply off this support level. So right now I'm holding this position. I didn't take any profits yet, and we'll update you tomorrow on the status of this trade. The next chart is the Aussie dollar. Not much has changed here. Still waiting for uh, favorable risk to reward entries uh, that we have found in the other pairs. The next chart is the Euro dollar. As I mentioned during yesterday's report, prices came down and find, found support near that 78.6 FIB, around the 28.40 area, and prices have rebounded as well off this support level. This is similar uh, to the Kiwi uh, dollar. Both are short US dollar trades. So if you entered here at that 78.6, I would hold that trade, uh, placing a stop just beneath the low um, of the test of that FIB. It's my experience uh, with FIB levels that usually the first test or breach of a FIB level usually represents the low of the move, so I have a bullish bias now against the 128.24 low. The last chart is the dollar yen, and I am still in this trade. This is the hourly chart here. This is the uh, head and shoulder pattern that I mentioned a few reports back. I did enter near that 90.80 area, as I mentioned yesterday, and I'm still in this trade right now. Uh, my stop is located uh, it, just above this high right here, which is 90 in the 91.20 area, and I'm holding this trade as well. Prices did rebound a little bit. There was a sharp rally on the hourly, but I think they're finding a little bit of resistance here in the 89.60 area. So again, and another thing I wanted to mention is that prices may have found a double bottom here. Um, and let me zoom in a little bit. Uh, so zooming in a little shorter term here, I want to add the Fibonacci levels uh, to this chart because I personally did miss uh, that potential support level, and I am still in the short trade. Um, so holding right now, uh, I might take some profits on the short trade at that 50% FIB, which is near the uh, 88.30 area, uh, maybe half my profits at that point, and then look for prices to come down to that 87 area, which was the low of the double bottom. And let me zoom out again, and let me show you that double bottom so you can see exactly what I am talking about. That would be this low over here, and this low over here where prices did rally. Again, my name is Matt Russell. I'm an FX Power Course instructor here at FXCM. Thanks for listening.